Where are you? Mom, where are you? Right in front of you, Lita. Okay, come on. Here we are, camping at our favorite spot in the desert. <laughs> Blow me a kiss. Come on, you guys too. Is it robot yet? She's connecting the transistor right now. Look, Dad, there's his brains. <laughs> Was it supposed to do that? Lita. She was Gosh. Where are you, Mom? Lita? Did Nanny and I ever tell you about the Arrow's Comet? In ten years, I need you to promise me that you'll take the family to see it, honey. Dad, listen to me. We have to get our family back together, okay? Just let me take Nanny to the... There is no more family, Lita. But tonight, we're supposed to go. showing it off more than anyone. Happy Mother's Day, pretty lady. I am. Where have you been? Oh, I'm sorry, Mom. We need a little dance, you and I. Come on, show me your moves. <laughs> what are you doing? Where's Diane? I told you to stay in bed. Damn it, Rosie. Have you guys seen Lita lately? It's been a couple weeks, but if she tries anything, we'll be ready for her this time. Oh. Security, report to the south wing immediately. Where is she? She's dead. I told you a hundred times she's dead. <laughs> What are you doing? Your father said you're not allowed in here, Lita. Well, he's an idiot, and it better not see you again. Oh. <laughs> Come here. It's OK. Do you know where she is, sweetie? It's OK. I'm here now, OK, pretty lady? I'm going to take you somewhere special tonight. OK. <gasps> Diane, I knew you were here. It's me, Nanny. It's me, Lita. Oh, sweetie. <laughs> Let's get out of here.
Don't screw this up again, Teddy. Come on, Lita. Last time. Back away. You and your mom can take a hike, Teddy. I'm tired of you and everyone telling me what to do. If my mom was here, she would raise hell if she knew that we were separated. So unless you're going to help me, I suggest that you back away. Somebody get gangsta, Barbie. <laughs> you can't do this, Lita! Bring her back! <laughs> Sorry, Lita. But I don't think you lost. Sayonara! <laughs> What are you standing around for? Go get the car. Sweetheart, where are we going? Crazy. <laughs> you remember what tonight is. Bingo? We promised Mom we'd go see the heiress comment tonight. Don't you remember? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I am taking all of us back to the old camping spot tonight as a family. So we, uh, we have more friends, sweetie? You can say that. Hey, slow down! What was that? Nothing. He doesn't want to be with us, especially you. Yeah, let me walk away from him and Nanny like you did. I'm sure that'd make Mom real proud. Yeah, no, I just don't want to quit. Okay, look around. Is this a family? No, it, it's a lost cause. Okay, live your own life. Get a boyfriend. I'm sure you'll meet someone nice in prison. For the last time, stay away from me. Dad, please come with us. We're supposed to go to the desert. I don't need to be around an atheist. Dad! Jeff! You still have a family. Stop praying your life away. It doesn't matter to you what I do with my life. According to you, it's all for nothing. Isn't that right? Life isn't about heaven, Dad. It's about now. And we should be spending time together now while we're still here. Don't you remember what tonight is? If there's no heaven, Lita, then where is she now? Huh? I don't know. Mom would be disgusted with you, ditching us and then hoping some god will solve everything. No, she's going to hell. You know, I think it's been 50 years, sweetie. Since what? Since you planted those flowers in the backyard. Remember how they glowed when we found them? Who am I, pretty lady? You're di- uh, No, uh, <laughs> Stop quizzing me, honey. I- I don't appreciate it. Don't you remember all the camping trips we did together? Or the church picnics? 
Don't you remember me? I don't know, okay? You don't think I know I'm confused, sweetie? I'm sorry, Nanny. <laughs> that little you know what is gonna get it, little thief. Mom, don't you mean kidnapper? Keep it up, Teddy. Maybe you should go teach English. Now, man up! Leader, do you want to go to jail? Fuck off, jackass! My dad gave me permission to take her! <laughs> Hold on. Not this time, little girl. Just drive, Mom. Oh, watch the road! <laughs> All this for a stupid camping trip? We'll get you now. Remember all the times we used to stop by here? <laughs> We're going in, all right? Let's try to be a family for one night. have a family who loves you, Nanny. What family? Come on, Nanny. Let's sit down. Good job. Telling me what to do. Well, maybe I wouldn't have to if you did the right thing in the first place. Like what? Like taking us to see the comet? I never promised that. Yeah, I hadn't even heard about this comet until today. Well, it shows how much you people remember. Or maybe you're just making it up. Wouldn't be the first time you're scheming you. something that's oh, so my innocent. God! Where on earth have you folks been? Oh, we've been tied up. Rosie, sweetie, how are you doing? There's a robot under the table. You gonna go on the floor and dance with Diane? You kids, no one could dance better than Rosie and your mom. Excuse me. Uh, well, you know, I, uh, you, I'll just go get y'all some malts. Yeah, thanks, Trish.
Rosie and Diane. I mean, I mean Rosie and Linda. <laughs> Lita, I need you to come with me. Get over here. No, Danny, no, Lita! Hey, hey, Lita. hey, hey. Yo, stop! Quite frankly, it's embarrassing that you got this far. But you're not gonna threaten my son's job again. You understand? Marsha. <laughs> well, well, well. If it isn't the sergeant himself. I hope you don't think you're above the law here. Just promise me you'll take him to see the comet. I don't know why. My mom really wanted us to see it, okay? Last time we were here, she told me her cancer had come back. She tried to keep it a secret. I didn't know what to do. And I left you guys here. I just got in the truck, drove off. I'd forgotten that. Then the next week, you know, she was in the hospital again. And in and out, in and out. God knows how many times. You're my good boy. And I ruined that last night we all had together. She would have given you permission to be happy, Dad. Uh, I doubt she forgave me, honey. Not after that. Hey. Danny, where you going? I remember going with Diane when she was little, over that way. Nanny, there's nothing out there. It's where the ceremony is. Oh. What? Lita, Dad, she's leaving. Come on, Dad. Lita, please. Dad, it's okay. Really, I don't want to be here. Sorry. Lita. Dad, look. What? Hey, what's what's going on? Is this pollen? Where is it coming from? Look closely. Their mom's 
those flowers. They're the stars and arrows. Mommy? Yeah? Where did Daddy go? Why did he leave? Kids, did Nanny and I ever tell you the legend of the Arrows Comet? No. Well, it's a very old desert legend. When humanity was young, a celestial maiden fell from the stars and became friends with everyone who lived in this land. She was well known for cultivating flowers, which had the power to brighten anyone's day. She even married, and she had two little kids. <laughs> One day, the woman was called back to the heavens against her will and forced to leave everyone she loved behind. So that she could remind her loved ones that she was still alive. She would return to this land every 50 years to awaken the stars of Eros. When the comet returns in 10 years, I need you to promise me that you'll bring your dad to see it. Won't you be here, Mommy? Lita, I will always be with you. As long as you remember me. Sometimes, you'll hear my voice comforting you. Other times, you'll share the love I taught you. And that's because I'll always be right here, right now, living inside of you. So do you promise to bring him? I promise, Mommy. Good. Because I think he will love it. She did forgive you. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. <laughs>